Hi, so I uploaded this video to my Facebook Reel and uh, some of my audience asked how to make animation like this. So in this uh, video, I will share how to create this product animation. But before that, as this is the end of June 2025, if you have some question about Canva design in Canva, I mean, or a tutorial that you want me to make for you, please uh, leave in the comment and I will try to figure it out and then create the tutorial for you on July. Okay, so now let's go to Canva. Choose Instagram post size. The main element is the product, right? You can upload your product here. But I will show you how to easily uh, create a simple, just for example, uh, the product is as I show you. This is a watermelon drink in a can. So first I will add a watermelon here. On the photos, I will choose this uh, slice watermelon. I'll make it here so it will be half of the page. And then I will add a full watermelon like this. All right. And then I will increase the size to uh, cover this page. And then I will send it to back. All right. And then let's. Uh, I will drag it here, okay. And then I will add, just for example, the brand. Uh, I will type here, press. You can use your own brand, of course. I will choose on the graphic, just choose, for example, this one, okay. And then go to edit. So it can be uh, visible in this design. I will add, uh, shadow go to shadow and i will add outline i will change the color to white and then i will increase the size okay and then i will write increase the size of this logo all right then and then i will download it as png click download all right now go to canva home and to apps and then scroll down to find this mockup. Okay, back to the previous page and then upload this design here. Okay, now back to mockup and then choose the packaging on the beverage tab and then, and then scroll down to find the can uh, mockup. It's far, far in the bottom. So the scrolling speed will be depend on your connection and your computer spec. And then I will choose this one. Click select and choose on your upload photo. And then next. And then adjust image if you want to adjust. Okay, but I think it's enough. Okay, I can do nothing here. Oh, I will increase a little. All right, and then click save and save mockup and then download this mockup back to the first page and then I will add a new page. Okay, first just remove it. Okay, I will move it and I will move it to the bottom, this page. And then upload the mockup here. And then remove the background. I will remove this uh, shadow. Okay, and then crop the box. Just to make it um, more simple to be moved. And then I'll place it here. Now let's add the previous watermelon. I will reduce the size. I think it's maybe, yeah, like this. And then go to BG Remover. 
I will remove the red part, click it once again. I will manually remove the red part, just drag it from here, make the curve, don't be too perfect. All right, and then close it. Okay, now we have it. And then scroll down to the frame, see all on the basic shape, see all. Scroll down to find this arch down frame. And to the page, increase the size, the width, I mean, as the width of this watermelon, and move it down and crop it. Uh, move it here and then increase add uh, an element type here water enter on the video this one and then add to the page and remove the background to remove the top part okay now let's trim it click here on the scissors icon I will make it only 8 seconds enter and uh, I want to uh, remove that part so I will move it here let's see uh, it's more stable I like it and then click done okay and then insert this to the frame okay I will increase it a little ah yes double click on it and then increase the size and reduce the size a little click done play it okay and then send it behind the watermelon and then add this product here press your control button to avoid it inserted to the frame and then move it to a forward okay and then go to animate and scroll down to add a wiggle i will reduce the intensity okay and then this is not uh, so natural so go to position layers and uh, click the water and then right click and duplicate place the duplicate right on the origin uh, click here and then press your control button and click here and then right click align element center right click again align element middle Alright, and then uh, click the top part and reduce the transparency. Add this more. Okay, and move it behind the watermelon, but in front of the cane. Okay, now let's play. You see, this is not uh, synchronized movement but if we download it it will go well uh, go to element add the watermelon and then reduce the size and place it here and send it to back and then type shadow here and on the graphic i will choose this one and place it here Reduce the, uh, the transparency a little. Position, layers, and send it behind all of this element. Duplicate and place it on the full watermelon. Okay, and then I will in uh, add some gradient here. Just click on the page. Click background color. And then click here. Click gradient. And then add more color and then I will choose a, this style so I will change this white with this red 
and this gray to white this gray to white you can add a name here or the tagline anything and then click share download as mp4 and page one only click done and download so this is the result if you like this video please hit the like button share the link to your social media and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching see you next video and have fun with canva